Really important topic at 635. Did you know that households with children are twice as likely to be impacted by food insecurity? The Capital Area Food Bank's hunger report breaks it down this way. 49% of DMV families with kids didn't have enough food to eat last year, but DC Central Kitchen is doing its part to change those numbers. The organization is bringing fresh food directly to marginalized neighborhoods in DC's food deserts. Ardelia Gonzalves has a closer look at the healthy Corners program. Along South Capitol Street. No, no, it's all you, buddy. It's all you. <laughs> Take care of business. Elmira Market is a business that feels like family. Definitely. I mean, we, we see our customer base as family. One, two, three. Dawi Kabru and his brother took over the business from their parents two years ago. A decision his father made in 2011 has become an investment in the health and well being of families here in Bellevue. We wouldn't have made the jump to actually make, to actually start bringing in fruits and vegetables here because. Nobody asked for it. Enter DC Central Kitchen's Healthy Corners program. The nonprofit provides corner stores with a cooler full of fresh fruits and vegetables. Elmira Market has since expanded to offer potatoes, onions, even frozen veggies. Cabru says customers are embracing the change. Everything's positive, especially the children or even younger people around my age. They do want healthier options like this. There are still just three big box grocery stores for more than 165,000 people who live east of the river. Many advocates say it's no coincidence that DC Health reports the average life expectancy in this neighborhood is 21 years less than parts of the district flush with grocery stores and fresh food options. This program is a, is a small step in leveling the playing field and decreasing the inequities in food access in our city. Mike Curtin, the CEO of DC Central Kitchen. One of the first things we were looking to combat was these sort of worn out, lazy, simple minded tropes or, or racist stereotypes that uh, people who live in marginalized communities won't eat fresh food. Everyone wants to feed their family healthy food. And if we can provide a way, a consistent way to access fresh, healthy, affordable food in a dignified way, that's going to go a long way. Healthy Corners keeps prices affordable. At Elmira and 28 other markets, customers can use SNAP or DC WIC benefits to get free food with their purchase. The program is a huge success. It's now in 53 corner stores throughout the city and sells 8,000 units a week in teeny little grocery corner stores that some are no bigger than a couple hundred square feet encased in bulletproof glass. So you cannot tell me that if you are marketing this product, again, in an affordable, dignified way in a larger setting, you will have customers, you will have a market. We've proven that. I feel like we are making a change and I hope that we can do better. Now Elmira Market is turning a corner and expanding. In the next two years, owners are hoping to build a kitchen in this back area of the store. They plan to partner with The Well, a farm over an auction run park to offer fresh food, meals, and cooking demonstrations for the community. In the Bellevue section of Southwest, Delia Gonsalves, WUSA 9.